Previously on Playmakers. Commandment one, you play to win. Do you see anything? He's lying there. He can't move. He's not playing because two weeks ago he hurt someone? This is football. Coach took you off injured reserve thinking you were 100%. He has a right to know if you're not. Taylor may be our past, the source says, but Harris is our future. He got us on a felony possession. I heard coaches pissing blood. I had an uncle piss blood once. A month later, he was dead. You're dropping me so you can give Harris an extension. Just suspend it. First week in rookie camp, they warn you about the piss man. Director thought you might like some water. We'll be with you shortly. Ephedrine, Andro, anabolic steroids, HGH, marijuana, cocaine, you name it, the league tests for it. Two players a week at random. Take the wrong kind of cough syrup and you're gone for eight games. Automatic and without pay. The only guy who should terrify you more than me is the piss man. Do you understand what substances are banned by the league? I got an idea. Do you have any reason to believe you will test positive for those substances? No, I do not. Please stand. Remove your shirt. beneath the knee. And your underwear too. Union says players gotta take this shit. Stripping down for the piss man, getting eyeballed by a guy you know wants to toss your salad. No foreign objects. Who give us a good sample? You may begin. You do blow, you're pissing it out for 72 hours. I did some day before yesterday. You do the math. First rule of football, team wins, you win. Scoreboard, it's all that counts. You believe that ever since Pop Warner. Now, you're not so sure. Man, you should think about coaching the way you show me that game from the bench. Am I talking to you, Rook? When, when you're done playing, I'm just, Are we even having this conversation right not, now? I'm just saying. Yeah. What are you saying? I'm, man, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go celebrate. It's a fact. The team wins. He wins. Yeah. 
And when he wins, I lose. You okay? Yeah, man. We got the W, right? <laughs> oh, damn bull is what you are. Let's do my job. You're such a prick. Which one? <laughs> well, you didn't hear this from me, but the piss man's coming. And you're on the list. When? Soon. Before the next game. It's cool. It better be. I can't bail you out if it's not. Yo! Yo, listen up! You should be proud of yourselves. Yeah. Yeah. through some mistakes and came out with a great win. Yeah. 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 Dog picked up every blitz, got down front on screens, and had enough left in OT to spring Harris with the best downfield block I've seen all year. Yeah. Balls of steel, my friend. Add this to the collection. <laughs> Game ball number two. McConnell. Where the hell's McConnell? The life expectancy of the average American is 76. The life expectancy of a pro football player is 58. No shit. It's not easy cutting 20% off your life. You need help. Naproxen, endomathacine, Vioxx, Meroxicam. MRI results are negative. No sign of cranial bleeding, which means no concussion. Good to know. How's your shoulder? Never better. Seriously, McConnell. I'm fine. That's not candy. The pain I'm in right now, it hurts even just to listen. I see from your chart, you're at 210, up from 195. And coach has me hitting the weights. Maybe. But I want to run some tests. And until I get the results, I want you off this stuff. <laughs> Blow me. I'm serious. What are you still doing here, man? Coach didn't go to me in OT. We won. That's all anybody's got to remember. We're 12 yards out, and he calls a running play? As it was second down, man. You don't risk a fumble if you have confidence in your kicker. First down, second down, it doesn't matter. You believe in your guy, you send him in. You messed up in the fourth quarter. It was from 39 yards. He barely got the snap down. The point is, it wasn't your day. I got three kids, a fourth on the way. My contract's not guaranteed. Look, it happens to everyone. The coach cuts me, I get nothing. Is Lucinda waiting for you out in the lounge? I'll hang with her until you're ready to come out. Things don't go your way. No one feels sorry for you. And you best not feel sorry for yourself, or you won't push. Be ready when you get the opportunity to show what you can do. Uh, guard dog, get your ass over here. Are you lift on game day? Game day for you. I just had a front row seat. <laughs> and what I saw was you making DH look good. Holes you made, my old lady could have gained a buck and a half. You never need holes like that for me. Hey, what can I say? I'm feeling good, you know what I mean? <laughs> feeling good. Yeah. Man, what are you, 32? 33 this week. Ain't no such thing as feeling good in this league of joy. Well, with our little help, there isn't. Anytime you're interested, I can hook you up. 
Uh, I made it this far on my own. I'm not looking for a leg up now. Man, you were the shit in your prime. If you want to rerun all that dodging and weaving you did back then, there's one way to get it. You gotta level the playing field with all these young guys, you know what I mean? Enjoy your workout. Strike like Q-tip. Q-tip. Like name Yo, go get right of my boy. What's wrong with you? The boy named himself like after him. Yeah. We have to have this conversation every time. Like this is better, huh? Yeah, like that man cat nine times to be respected. Yo, we need to put an end to this shit. Story, DH, if you, the you the had one chance, one chance with Halle Berry, you taking it with Q-tip or 50 Cent? That's gonna solve anything. I respect the man's opinion. Q-tip. Snoop Dogg. There you go, yo. Q-tip or 50 Cent. He says Snoop Dogg. Oh, man. And suddenly you feel the grip tugging on you. Gently. A little kid running an autograph. And that's how it starts. All innocent and shit. Try and forget about it. Push it out of your mind. Let it get stronger. Not all at once, but a little at a time. Then you remember the piss man. Make his year to mess you up. That's when you decide to face the grip. Straight up, man to man. Shit's on now. You wear slippers because you can't bend over to tie your shoes. You're 26, and for days after the game, you shuffle like an old man. Dislocated shoulder, bruised sternum, turf toe, and you're blamed for it. You enjoy punishment, McConnell? You like taking abuse? Not really good. Well, I think you do. I think you enjoy getting your ass kicked. If you didn't, you wouldn't hold on to the ball so damn long. 3.7 seconds. You make the play under that, we got ourselves a drive. You stand around playing with yourself, we got nothing. <laughs> Snap to the point of impact. Any idea how long that was? Month? Month and a half? <laughs> <laughs> Let's count, shall we? Thousand one. You average 20 sacks a year. Two. You play 10 years. Thousand three. You'll get laid out 200 times. Thousand four. Works out you lose about one month of your life per sack. And coach thinks you give a shit about seconds. Only thing you care about is survival. What's up, mate? Thirteen knee operations. You'd think I'd be done with this. Gave would hook you up with any of that Lux cam? Yeah, he gave me a script. Let me crib a couple, I'm running short. How you doing, McConnell? We gotta get going. Those tests I told you I wanted to run? We're gonna be late. How's your shoulder? Still's working good. Huh, glad to hear it. 
Let's go. Thanks, mate. You can't believe anything could hurt more than playing. Until you don't. Baby? Yeah. Eric's downstairs. It's time for practice. Is there something you want to talk about? No. You know, look, I know things are hard right now. I said I don't want to talk about it. If you need anything, I'll be on my cell. I got a lot to do to get ready for Friday. The Foundation's making its annual presentation. That's this week? Leon, we only need you for a couple of hours. Fine. Baby, it's your foundation. I know whose damn foundation it is. I said I'm doing it. Look, baby, come here. I'm sorry. Yeah. Eric's waiting. You should go. Robin's the best. The kids are great. And I'm the asshole. I know. We've been over this. I'm just saying, you got problems at the office, not at home. That's all I'm saying. Look at you getting all Dr. Phil on me. <laughs> inner child, baby. It's all about the inner child, huh? I like, give me some of that. <laughs> hey, look, man, I'm glad you're sticking with the team. In case I haven't mentioned it. Not banging on your head like a coconut. That puts us in the bowl of you. <laughs> Tapping my head, man. You gotta be honest, it was a little weird. <laughs> but it helped me to play. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Do you see the game? I did pretty good. Seven tackles plus a sack. Are you feeling anxious? Got St. Louis coming up. <laughs> You'd be anxious too. Do the memories of what happened continue to reoccur? <laughs> You're still feeling it, aren't you? You're actually experiencing it again? Playing. It's what matters. And your father? Man killed my brother. It's my cross. I get that. You ever heard of post traumatic stress? Like dudes in war freak out when they come home. Well, anyone who's experienced significant trauma can suffer from it. Symptoms are similar to depression, can be treated with antidepressants. Antidepressants? Well, you think I'm a nut job? No. Just that you need a little help. You know, I, I could have called, said I was uh, moving forward over the phone, but coming here, I thought I owed you that. Saying thanks. Letting you know I'm not coming back. So good, why is he available? He missed the game winner last month in Seattle. They cut him a week late. Dev, hey, uh, coach asked me to ask you to meet him in his office after practice. He didn't tell me why or anything. Just wanted me to let you know. man's coming. I don't care if the players' union agreed to random testing. You're my agent. I don't pay you 3% for you to be telling me about some agreement. Harris! I pay you to get me out of shit like this. Harris! Hope we're not inconveniencing you. Check this shit out. Watch yourself, Blood. Watch yourself. Hey, Phillips! Show McConnell how offense is supposed to run. Power left, sweep right. Ready? Uh, Gatewood says he didn't go in for a test. Gatewood talks too much. I can get you a chair. I'm fine. It's just practice. Not even in pads. But you want in. And then you see it. 
You don't want to see it. You hate seeing it. It's not a move. It's a way of moving. Of greatness. Ain't anybody touch me, baby! Can't touch me! Huh? What? Can't nobody touch me! Let's do this. We gotta talk. How do you know we won't get caught? Random drug testing is like one of the worst kept secrets in the league. I get you. That's what they say, but how do you know? I got a source inside the substance abuse program. Check this out. The league stationary and everything. Those are the two players being tested this week. You're not one of them. Which means if you know when you're gonna be tested, you cycle off, you never get caught. Let's do it. All right. One thing I ask you to do. One thing you can't do. Hey, did, hey, did the piss man gain 147 yards last week? No, he did not. So don't be blowing his smoke up my ass. Piss man can't carry my job. All you gotta do is wait 48 hours for the piss man to test you, you'll go. But you can't. This man scares people, but the grip, he's a killer. Yo, what up, what's up, what's up? Yeah, so how much time you got to the test? Day, maybe two. And you gotta be pure. Snow White. So what do you know? First of all, that shit you do, it's in you. It shows you can't mask it. That's where my man Perry Smith comes in. NBA pre-draft workout, with clean piss and an aspirin bottle, stick it in his jock, pour it out during testing, passed every time. Yeah, then he went out and got himself in a motorcycle accident, never got a shot. That would have been a star, too. Playing in Italy. What the two of you shut up? To go number one. Yeah, in his dream. Shut up! So what do you think? They have new rules since then. Shit's full frontal now. Guy even holds the cup. Only way not to pee out what's in me is not to have it in me. I know this guy. The drug test where he works at. The week that he was gonna be testing, he was using. My man could not lose his job, but his old lady would carve his ass up. So? You're not gonna wanna do what he did, man. Well, first I'm gonna give you a, a diuretic. That's gonna help us empty your bladder. And then with a catheter, I'm gonna go right inside your bladder to insert the, the clean urine. So you wanna put clean urine in me? That's right. By using a catheter. That's like a small tube. And we insert that right in the end of your penis. Doc must be some kind of faggot thinking you'd let a guy do that. Tell me more. The ligaments in your big toe are so mangled, you need surgery on it after the season. Until then, you wear so much tape on it that the equipment manager has to cut a hole in the top of your shoe just so it fits. Feels good. Hey, Pat. Would you excuse us? It's okay, Pat. Did good. Now your test results, Pat. You have something called membranous glomerulonephritis. 
Which in English means? Treatable kidney disorder. Won't keep you from playing. Excellent. <laughs> Derek, your kidneys are like a waste disposal system. When they work correctly, they flush out excess fluid. Yours aren't doing that, which is why you put on weight. Okay, so fix it. I'm going to, but you have to help by going off anti-inflammatories. They could be what's causing this, and if they are, you keep using, they might make it worse. If I don't use, I can't walk, let alone play. I don't recommend Coach George place you on the inactive list until you heal naturally. And when's that gonna happen? Two months? Maybe, maybe more. Why don't you I mean, just put you me on IR? Serious, it's crap the whole season. Bad, I'm not sitting you out. Worse. You're going on the inactive list, effective immediately. Guard dog tells you it takes a while for the andro to kick in. But once it does, you feel good. Look at you kicking some serious ass. <laughs> hey, push it up to 245, will you? Where is he? Where's DHF? Yo, where is he, man? Huh? This brother right here? This brother right here took care of a brother's fine. Fifty oh, large, baby. I don't know what you're talking about, man. Yo, man, I feel like it was nothing, man. He didn't even ask me. Yo, bro, if you ever need something, I got your back, all right? You clean, right? Better than ask me that. This man's coming. I'm on the list. Oh, shit. I got a way out, though. I can't take no tests for you, man. Well, all I need is a clean sample. Oh, you know the coach already suspended me for being late. You know you what I can do it down. if I find me cheating You're not going to get caught. Oh, DH, man. You... No, forget it. Oh, DH, man. I yeah. said forget it. It's my problem. Glad you're back. Hey, yo, man, show me what you got, bro. Pass. 18 reps at 245. What, you can't do that? You can't hang? Why are you always looking to get shown up? We gonna do this or what? Oh yeah! <laughs> What's up, fellas? Oh, yeah. All right. Count of three. Uh huh. One, two, three. Yeah. One, One, two, two, two three, three, four, four. 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 You scared him, man? I don't know, but it sure felt good. I wanted to say goodbye. What you talking about? You didn't hear? Coach cut me. Nah, I didn't know. Man, you'll look up somewhere. It won't take you long. Look, what happened to Corey? I want you to know how much I admire the way you handled it. Thanks, man. See you around. See you around, man. He's on the list. Slow down, man. There were two names on that list. B. H. and Mendes. Yeah, I know, so? So the piss man isn't gonna test a player who's no longer on the team. They test two players a week. This week, Mendez was supposed to be one of the two. Now he's gone, and someone will be taking his place, and that someone could be me. Look, first of all, we don't even know if they're gonna add someone. Point is, they could. If they do, Leon, there's only one in 52 chance. I am not a cheater, do you understand that? Okay. I play fair, I play by the rules. It's not gonna happen. You said I could cycle on and off and never get caught. Now you're saying I have a one in 52 chance of pissing away my whole career. You said it was a lock.
Hey, you uh, you play football like your old man? I'm on a team. Oh yeah. Well, what position you play? Coach says only dirty players lead with their helmet. You want to say it was a clean hit, that you went in shoulder first, but you don't. Not because he's a kid and his dad's never gonna walk again, but because suddenly you're not sure. And then you see it. You don't believe it at first, so you play it again. And that's when you know Corey's kid was right. He paralyzed his dad with a dirty hit. Thank you. Thank you very much. We're here today to honor recipients of the Run for Daylight Foundation's annual Hero Awards. You were going to do well by doing but good. But before I recognize these deserving winners, I want to salute the men whose drive to give back made all this possible. You were going to be a role model. Who I promise you is an even better person. My husband, Leon Taylor. But instead, you're a phony. Today was important to a lot of people. It was important to me. The least you could have done was fake it. But I told you I had a lot on my mind. Tell me about Samantha. This isn't about her. Well, who is she? Robin, listen. Woman calls my house? I think I have a right to know who she is, Leon. Look, I made a tape, for real, to see if I'd be any good on TV after I was done playing. Samantha is Sam Lovett from Channel 7. She was helping me out. That's it? Then why keep it a secret? Because it's nothing. It was a stupid idea that's never going to happen. Well, if this isn't about her, then what's it about? I took something. Andrew. Leon. Look, I needed a boost, something to give me an edge. You cheated! Well, it's legal in baseball. The guy who does the testing is coming tomorrow. And he may be looking at me. If he does, I'll fail. Legal suspend me eight games without pay. After that, I'm finished. I stood up there today and told everyone what a great man you are. I never thought saying that would be a lie. I'm not gonna put our quarterback on the inactive list. He needs time to heal. A and he'll get it in the off season. If he keeps sucking back anti-inflammatories, he might be at risk for- I'm not gonna kiss off our season because of what might happen. Alonzo Mourning, Sean Elliott, guys like that. I mean, these guys had serious kidney disorders and they think that any- They think, they don't know. I mean, come on, Alan, what are you talking about? Two guys against what, 2,000? Come on, there wouldn't be a pro game played in this country. I'm talking any game, players stop taking anti-inflammatories. You know that. Derek McConnell has a serious kidney disorder. Do I have permission to treat it or not? For now, he plays. You gonna let me deal with that? Yeah. Real soon. I was uh, wrong. Good. Because I went online and looked up members, gloom or whatever, and it scared the shit out of me. No, I was right about my diagnosis. What do you mean? Do I have it or don't I? Hey, Doc. Can I wait? Yes, you do. Well, what were you wrong about? You're going on the inactive list. It won't be necessary. And the anti-inflammatories? Shouldn't be a problem. But I thought you said that. I told you I was wrong.
They're squeezing you, aren't they? I'll uh, keep monitoring and make sure it doesn't get any worse. Coach, Will Banks, they're telling you I got to play no matter what. If I could prove a connection, it'd be different. McConnell. You really believe that? Sit! That is DH. Demetrius Harris. Tell the doc I can come in at any time. Thank you. What's that? This is what we call a Foley catheter. I'm going to insert this inside you. This is the uh, clean urine and the syringe. All I simply do is in inject that inside you through this catheter. Any questions at all? No. Well, let's get started, shall we? Whoa. What do you think you're doing? Uh, but this is topical lidocaine. I have to rub it on the end of it just to numb it. You're gonna rub your fingers where? But you know, this is a this is an invasive procedure. You're gonna want some form of anesthetic. I can promise you that. Let me get a nurse, your girlfriend, whatever. Nobody knows about this. I understood that you wanted to keep it that way. You try any bullshit? Now this shouldn't hurt, but if it does, you just let me know. We're going in right now. Okay, it's going in now. Just need a little air bubble so that you're doesn't come loose inside here. All over in a few seconds. Okay. You're gonna wanna take a piss, just don't. Okay? Mm-hmm. That's okay, man. Okay, I'm gonna take it out now. There you go. You're good to go. The piss man's here. Harris. Yeah, coach. Breakout room. Now. No problem. Mendez was next on the list. But now that he's gone, the piss man selected someone else. You want to tell him what you did, how you beat him, how you kicked his ass. Thank you, Mr. Harris. That'll be all. Then you feel that little tug, the grip, reminding you a price will be paid. Mr. Harris? Makes you think maybe you were fighting against the wrong guy. Nothing to it. Just know whatever happens is gonna be okay. 
Mr. Fredericks. Do you understand what substances are banned by the League? Everything worked out. Yes, I do. I wasn't tested. Now listen, I'm sorry I put you through that. You put our family through that. I know, and it won't happen again. Our name, our work in the community, our kids. What do you think people would say to them if they knew their daddy tested positive? It was a mistake. But it's over and it won't happen again. I want to believe you, but you're keeping things from me now. That scares me. Tell me more about him. Everything you put yourself through during the week, and you still have to take a needle in order to play. Ten minutes, you'll be good as new. Thanks. Gotta keep the horses on the track. You think about it. That's what it's all about. Keeping the players on the field no matter what. So you don't think about it. Any of it. The needles, the pills, the fact that six days a week you can't stand up straight. You deny it all. You have to. Because if you ever really think about what's happening, playing this game is costing you 18 years of your life. You never play another down. Stay tuned for scenes from the next Playmakers. You're straight, right? Cal was with you. Your friend Cal was found guilty on three counts of aggravated assault. They're my friends. You stay with the friends that you grew up with, they are gonna drag you under. I may be traded. Now, if I stay here, I'm never gonna play. You know what your problem is, McConnell? What's my problem? You're never gonna be a winner. Look around. All this is because of me. Now, we made this together. Oh, please, I made it, you furnished it. You cost us the game, maybe the season. And all I can say is you messed up. Thanksgiving Day.